could have found some other place for his air raid stuff. getting sand on the roof in case there's an air raid. You know, I... Well, I hope you won't think of any other girls while I'm gone. I, oh, honey, don't be silly. Well, ever since we've been married, all my old girlfriends are behind me. Well, then you won't be looking at these anymore. No. Oh, for goodness sakes, I wonder where they came from. I wonder. Hmm. Hey, you might as well take this one, too. Now, there you are. Oh, I had no idea it was so late. Harry will put you up until morning, and then I'll be here with the minister. I'll, I'll be right down. Oh, yes. 
Go out. I don't wanna. No. Rex! Rex! Oh, oh Rex. Quick. There's a strange woman in my house. A strange woman? Yeah. Come here. There she is. Well, so what? That's my fiance. I've got to get back to camp and I have to have a place to leave her tonight. Oh, no. Nothing like that. How can I explain that to my wife? Listen, friend or no friend, you got to get out of here. How do you like that for appreciation? Here's a guy refusing an old pal a simple favor. I guess you forget that you owe me your life. I know, but since then I've been married. Listen, honey, let me tell you about this. Yeah. We were in swimming. Yeah. He went down for the first time. And he came up. He went down for the second time. Then he came up. And he was just about ready to go down for the third time. I came to the rescue. And despite his struggles, managed to hit him. Like this. And then, fighting my way through the breakers, I managed to get him to shore. And then there was another time, too. I'll never forget we were down in Africa. Oh, and that big rhinoceros. It's all right. She can have her own. She can have it. Harry, that swallow you. I knew you'd eventually see it my way. Mm -hmm. Oh, gee, honey, I told you he was a swell guy. And I'll be here the first thing in the morning with the minister. Oh. Say, what time did you expect Rex and the minister in the morning? Oh, about nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Well, that's all right. I'll set the alarm so you wake up in time. <clears throat> well, this is the first time we've been apart in the month we've been married. Sleep tight. P.S. I'll be thinking of you, your darling wife, Gertrude. Gee, am I a lucky guy. A fine guest room. Not even a pillow on the bed. Now listen here. You keep that door closed. And don't come in here again. in there either. Well, how do you like that? Now, you go... Dead? Oh, I'm so glad. 
I don't know what came over me. No. Oh, you poor boy. Let no. me take you and clean you up. Hello, hello. Hello, Harry. I just had to call and say goodnight. Have you missed me? Well, not exactly, you see. You just sit there and be quiet, and I'll get the dirt off you. Harry, you're going to tell me at once what's going on. Wait, I'm, I'm sitting on the everybody's bathtub. You see? No, I hey, mean... Why don't you hang up on that table and show me to get the dirt off you, huh? Who is that person? Where did she come from? Who is that person? Where'd she come from? Why'd she come from? She came into the house right after you'd left, darling. Oh, so you've broken your promise. I'll be home immediately. Hey, come on, quick, quick. Get out, get out. Get out, my wife's coming home. Get out, you two. No, not you two. You two, go. Get out, my wife's coming. Quick, quick, go. Shush. Shouldn't have taken you in the first place. Why, there's no one out there. No, keep him Fred. I never heard of him. You will. He's my ex-boyfriend. He'll kill both of us. What? Lie right there. Hey, what goes on here? You can't do a thing like that. Will you lie down and be still? Leave everything to me now. Well, I've already been to bed. Hundred and fifty, three hundred, four hundred. So you thought I couldn't find you, huh? Who's this guy? I'm here from the blood bank to get this gentleman's donation. Shh. Shh. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, don't let me interfere. Go right ahead. Go ahead. Mm-hmm. 